Alola, welcome to the Wolf Pack. My name is Sand Distress83, and welcome back to new Pokemon Snap. We're going, we're finally going to Durice today, guys, and we're starting off with the Shiver Snowfields. And I'm genuinely excited because we're going to the Snowfields during the day. I feel like we're gonna find like a lot of maybe ice or steel, and my, a lot of ice types, obviously, but maybe some steel types. And this will just be in generally. Wait, was that a Skarmory? I still saw. Okay, we got like a Furritz. <gasps> a bomb! Oh my god, am I, what am I? The ice types I use: Bear Tick. Wait, what the? What are those? We got some Swine Up. What lives here? Ah! In Is it coming out? Or do I have to force it out? Ah! <gasps> Cub Chew! Oh my god, Cub Chews are so adorable! Hello! Little Cub Chew. I, would I actually love this place. It's nice and relaxing. There's all kinds of ice types. And it's so snowy. <gasps> Mama swine. Oh my god. And there's Skarmory. I oh my god. Let's get the Skarmory. Hey everybody. Here's some food. Oh. Okay, I see. Wait, what gender is this one? They're all, are they all female? Oh, this one's a male. The ones that one's the, two of them are female, and this one's a male. So there are fan. There's two families here. Okay, I get. So two of them are the parents. To one of each. To one swine up each. Now what gender is the? Okay, so both swine up are female. Okay. It's good to know, honestly. Very helpful, in fact. Consider. Oh, oh no. Uh, okay, we got some snow run. Ah, gotcha. Oh, <gasps> snom. Got myself a snom. Now, what lives down here? What else lives down here besides this? Not really a lot. Oh, I see it. It's a glaily. I'm actually... Okay. I don't have any crystal crystal illuminic orbs. But I know that's a glaily. And trust me, I know my glailies. I think every Pokemon that's in this area, here in this island are new to me in this game. Let's see. Oh? Is that a... Oh, Piplup! And a feel. Not bad. Okay, so what else is there? Oh, imagine there's like shiny Pokemon that appear in this. Okay. Now, what else is there to find? Or is that it? Oh, hi, buddy. You like that hot water? <gasps> okay, another bear tick. Aw, piplups are adorable. Especially in this place. Oh my god, the, the tree branches with the snow on it look like giant claw hand, hands with claws. I love this. This is my dream come true. Well, 
Welcome back. Those are my brand new cores. I can't wait to see them. And I can't wait to show you them. I'll be right back, everyone. Okay, and we are back in the action. And everything here is new. We're going to go for the best stuff we got. Like this three-starred. Okay. Everything's okay, I guess, here. Okay. All of these are... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What? Nice. Okay. Not... This is, this is genuinely not even that bad. All everything, of course. We're going through everything. For starters, we have the ferret. For the photo decks. I feel like I might not... I'm actually not even going to try to to fill up this entire thing. I'm going to see what I, whatever I find, I'll find. You know? And that scar me, it looks majestic. Up there. Ah, swine up. Hold on. Yeah, like for this area, fun fact. Some of the Pokemon, those some of the Pokemon you that are in this game are Pokemon I've actually used in previous Let's Plays. Like, take this area for example. Back in direct back during my let's play on when I was still you know back when I was still recording my let's play on Pokemon Shield, one of the Pokemon I used was actually a bear tick. Yeah, I never actually thought to use a Snom or a or the evolved form of Snom, you know, just in general. I might actually go for a Glalie though for my let's play in on Omega Ruby if I can find one that is. Speaking of which, I definitely recommend you subscribe to this channel and click that bell. And also, comment down below if you like this video. In fact, like the video while you're at it. You know? Now, let's see what happens from this results. Okay. Not bad. Leveled up. Never step forward for our research. I bet Pokemon here are getting comfortable with you. And we get another presence. Distant land. Bug collector. The ice type. <gasps> Ooh, and the steel type. And the bug type. By the way, thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. I'll fill you in once your photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. And, a gr and pleased I probably will. As long as there's more areas to explore. Or this area again just during the night. I'm actually very curious. Now let's see what we have. Hey Professor. That snow is quite a sight. It was a real a real treat to see it since it never snows on Florio. I'm looking forward to seeing it in the moonlight. If you spot the Illumina phenomenon in action, don't let its brilliance distract you from taking photos of it. Oh, that's right, we get to go right to, back to the place at night. In fact, Skarmory. Phil wants to see Skarmory flying. Okay. Not bad. Now we can go back. And now... Let's go back here tonight, tonight, you know? That way we can see what kinds of Pokemon we'll find during the night. I'm actually curious to see what we'll find here during the night time. Oh, hey, my Diana! Oh, that's right, I love those. I actually love my Diana. <laughs> you think? Why well, do you think I love snow so much and winter? It's amazing. Okay, we got <gasps> Frost Moth! Here, buddy. Have some food. Enjoy. Uh, 
<laughs> What's that? Is that a lol in sand slash? Oh my god, I wish I could have seen everything. Oh hey, more money and a and a ferret. Yes, good eye. Wait, this part what gender is this ferret? Wait, what? It's a Oh <gasps> Mighty Anna. I love Mighty Annas. They're actually I don't know what it is about them. I just really love the Pokemon. Braviary Well, it's time. Well, we just found ourselves a Braviary and an Obama Snow. That is nice. Hold on. We got the... Hold on, what? There is so much happening. I love this place at nights. Actually nice here. If I could get like a cabin out, make, move out here and get like, build like a nice cabin out, out here. I would love it here for like a family, like a, a little winter retreat. And I could feed all the Pokemon here. Especially all the ice and dark types I find around here. Because in case you guys don't know, when it comes to Pokemon typings, I prefer to use dark types and ice types. For different reasons. Speaking of which, you're not killing! That's right, Deli Bird. Nice. <gasps> oh, and there's a Jinx. And a Vanillish. Oh, sorry, a Vanilla Lux. My bad. I forget things sometimes. Hi. There's also Frost Moth. This is actually a very... Okay, let's get some photos of the... Vanillax. Okay, we're gonna zoom up a bit. So hold on tight, kids. Sorry, Piplup, coming through. Move. Thank you. You little shits. Well, I'm mean. To innocent Piplup. <gasps> oh, Alolan Vulpix. Nice. Favorite. Sweet. That was amazing. I love Alolan Vulpix. There we go. Bye, Alolan Vulpix. That was nice. Yeah, sure. Awesome. I actually found some nice Pokemon here. Some I would probably use in the Galar region in Pokemon Shield if they were if I could. I love this feeling I have. Hello, Logan. The time of day makes a big difference, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. The different kind of Pokemon you find. Awesome. Let's get the Mighty Ennas. There's you. 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 Let's get the Ferret. Okay. Not all bad happened here. Got some nice Alolans. This is a nice feeling, you know. Hehehe. <laughs> Okay. 
Gotta look through all my photos. Actually, I only have one of Braviary. There we go. We got the Crystal Boon. In effect. There we go. Now we can get the Illumina Orbs for this for this area. Okay, we're gonna find a lot of good stuff here. Like this Mightyena. Oh, majestic Pokemon, you know? Especially for being a Dark type. Fun fact. In case for those of you didn't notice, in Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, the, oh, the special, if you, when you learn how to like sneak up the Pokemon, the mind, the Poochiena you find, you could, you could potentially do that too, at the, when you first learn how to do that, will know one of the, of the different Fang moves, the Elemental Fangs. And it's very good to know, cause like there's fi Ice Fang, Thunder Fang, Fire Fang, different Fangs. I have, I got a, in Omega Ruby, I have a Poochiena that knows Ice Fang. And that's the only move it knows, in fact, right now. And if I could use that and Mightyena in, in Shield, I would love to. Ah, uh, but that's fine. This is nice. If this is how I spent the rest of my life doing this, stuff like this in the real world, I probably would have a nice amount of time. Also, I feel like these games remind me of, reveal some more about me that I didn't even know about myself. And, whatever than that, we got our photos. Okay. Oh, we were so close. We're just getting started with this after hours research. Good luck out there. I know you can do it. Okay, we got the grass collector and the ice collector and the machine-like precision. I mean, it's psychic. We got the... Bro. <gasps> By the way, now that we got that crystal, the crystal bloom info, I got something to report. I hope you're excited. Yes, I'm excited to get more Illumina orbs. Oh my god, this is fun. <laughs> Another round of Illumina phenomenon analysis complete. So here you are, Illumina Orbs for Doris Island. Those ought to open up some new doors in your research. And with a little more progress, we'll, I think we'll be able to locate the final Illumina Pokemon. You're doing wonderfully, wonderfully. Keep it up. Thanks, Professor. And we got some logo. Sweet. And we got a new request. The Frolics. We got five requests, in fact. Frolicking Furret. Howling in the heavens. At the heavens, a proud warrior. I like, like Powder Snow. Awesome. Actually, we should look at some of these photos. Pokemon Stadium 3. <gasps> I like it. I generally love this photo. They should make a, this as a, as a new Pokemon Stadium, specifically for the Switch. I would play that. Now we're gonna go back here during the night so we can get a more better, proper use for the Illumina Orbs for this area. Anything here? Some Piplups. Another Piplup. Another Mightyena. Oh. <gasps> Maybe that would help. <gasps> Weavile! Holy. Where is Weavile? I got the Weavile. I have targeted the Weavile. What are you supposed to be? Ugh.
Now we can keep moving. Okay. Nothing much new. <gasps> Wait, what's that Pokemon? Oh. Oh my god. That actually was a pretty good shot. And... We got more. Awesome, the snow runs. Here, have some food. Thank you. I love my Diana so much. Ah, also. Also, sorry again if I'm very quiet most of the time. I'm also really looking to, very into this, so I'm trying to find good Pokemon, you know? Ah, feels good. Ah, uh, here we go! Yeah. Well, it's nice knowing ya. Okay, let's see what else is here. There's Snom, there's the Delibird. There are the Jinx, and there's like... <laughs> oh hey, there's Crystal Boom. Don't worry, buddy. I'm on the way. This is really awesome. Here we go. Here. More light. Ah. Nice try, buddy. You ain't getting fired far. Oh, hey, there's another Piplup. <gasps> another Alolan Vulpix. Not bad. Oh, man. <gasps> I am a god. Okay. This is nice. Not a lot here. Except for the Weavile. That was good technique, honestly. I feel like I deserve something. Nope. Just you wait, I'm gonna gain even better shot than that. You really sure about that, kid? Look at all the ice types, they're so, oh my god. You know what, I make my decision. As a gym leader, I'd use dark types. But as an Elite Four, I would use Ice Types, okay? I just love both types too much. Also... We did get some decent- Oh, we found the Weavile, that's right! And we got more Sand Slash... Shots... Oh... You know what? Let's go everything! We're gonna skip through it all. Like, by holding down the B button. There we go, guys. Now you know the way. Okay. There we go. And a new discovery for our decks. I'll keep the more better ones. Okay. This one. And we got another Jinx. And this is the better shot. And there we go. Now let's get our results in. And we leveled up in this area during the night time, so that's good. Another step forward for our research. I bet Pokemon in the area game comfortable with you. Um, everyone is. Professional photographer got some nice. By the way, thanks to, your, to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. 
I'll fill you once your photo square. I think you'll be pleased to hear about this. And I think I am. What's gonna happen? Professor! Professor! I've heard I heard we found a new teleportation point. Word reaches you quickly, Rhea. That's a good quality of it for our assistant. Yes. We've been pointed another reading. It's coming from underground. Farther into the Reese Island. Whoa! We're going underground. This is gonna be awesome. The cave we'll be exploring looks quite deep. I'm counting on you to leave no stone unturned down there. I mean sure. Hey, can I talk to you for a sec? Has Professor told you yet? He gave us the green light to do some nighttime research at the beach. <gasps> you must be psyched to go too, right? I can't wait. I can't wait either. I'm excited. You know what? Wait, what did Magic Cop have? A present for a friend. That is something we all need. Friendship. Yeah, but before we go to the go back to the Reese Island, I actually wanna go. Hold on, I have to check this out now. I wanna see this during nighttime. I know this isn't related to the Reese Island, the, the, to the Derice Island, but screw it, we're gonna do it anyway. Okay, we got like a drift blim. What's that? In the back. Oh, <gasps> Zangoose. And we got a drift blims. I wonder that as well. Why don't we go check them out? Aw. There's no Alolan executor. That's right, you bozo. Get moving. Yeah. Some music. Yeah, food for when you wake up in the morning. Wait, are those? Is that an Inke? Those are Inke! Sounds like a blade is, is being sharpened. Oh my god, it does! What is back there? Oh, I need to see this. A Saviper! Oh, so there are Saviper in this game. That makes sense because there's Zengus. And we got some Inke. A lot of interesting Pokemon. I didn't expect to be here. Let's check out this area. How is that Magikarp alive? You think it would be dead by now, right? Just being up there? No one else is here. There's some Inkays. Anything else? Okay, we're gonna light up you. Wait, what? I've never seen Clam Pearl like that. Oh my god! I remember a little bit about Clam Pearls. Now. I've never actually seen a clam pearl in this case before. Okay, we still got the. Uh, <gasps> oh, Sandy Gast! I knew that's what it was. Cause like I remember there was that shovel right. You see like that, like that little shovel right there. It's like some Sandy Gast here.
That's perfect. Wait, what? Is that a Sandigast or a Palo Sand? Perfect. Unfortunately, no. It's no Palo Sands, I guess. Huh. Hey, fuck face. Here. That's right. Get out of my view. There you go. Have some food, buddy. Enjoy. See ya, buddy. See ya later. Now, where'd that Alolan Raichu go? <clears throat> that feels good. This was your first time out there at this hour. I want to hear all the all the Pokemon you you found there. Uh, yeah, found like this. Found this. One of these. One of these fellas. Found this. Found another clam pearl. And I found some sandy gas. Not bad. Now we're just going to skip through all of this and go back to Derice Island. Yeah, a new discovery, huh? Yeah, I'm skipping through everything. So we got like some... Oh, that's right, I remembered. I remember now after seeing both Zangus and the Viper in this game that those two are natural wa enemies of one another. Because like, you know, like, Zangus is basically like... I think it's like a muskrat, and I know that like Zen that like Saviper are obviously serpents. Oh, and this is some genuinely good water. Ah, I feel good. Hold on. There we go. I fixed my neck a little bit as well. And there we go, boys and girls. We are learning a lot about this place. Looks like you got the end of nighttime research. Keep up the good work. Oh, apparently I'm a flying type collector. Now we're going back to the Rice Island. Oh, sorry, I was just checking some. There we go. Okay, we're in the out of way caves now. So, without further ado, let's just get going. Oh my god, I like the Blastoise. Wait, are we in water? I think we would have drowned by now, right? What's down here? <gasps> oh, that's right, I think this is where we. What are you? Hi, buddy. Hi, Gengar. Oh my god, yes. Look at this. Ugh. Hi, Gengar. See you, Gengar. Oh, crap it! Come here! Now for the carbink. Okay, I got like my... The Gengar. Now what else lives around here? Besides the Pokemon I've seen so far. Okay. I think this is actually where we can go to find Diancy at some point. There's Crobat again. There's like another Glalie. 
Oh, hey, Crowbat. A gold. Oh, sorry. A Krogunk. I had to remember it for a second. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I'll be honest with you. Sinnoh was never really my favorite region. Also, comment down below. What is your favorite Pokemon region? And if you like, if you know which one you want, comment down below. Because then I get to learn a little more about you guys, you know? And you learn a little more about me. Personally, out of all of them, I love Alola. It's nice there. It's very tropical. And honestly, I would love to live there if I could. Alola is just a tr generally a nice place, you know? It's easy to relax, too. Oh, okay, we're going down here. What's here? What kind of Pokemon live here, huh? <gasps> okay, there's a Sableye. I found some Sableye. Anything else? Okay, there's a Gengar. It did. I got Gengar. Oh, that's right. Oh, no. Okay, let's see what else is here. <gasps> Rampardos! I love this! Awesome! Amazing! Here, guys! Have food! Okay. That was great technique, you know? Awesome. I didn't even think that would work. Wait, what are you? Oh, it's another Crobat. Okay. I was... Oh. oh. Okay. <laughs> it didn't work. In fact, I missed. That's how bad this was. <gasps> Geo dude. That's either a Gengar or it's a Haunter or it's a Haunter. Now that Vortex. Very cool. Okay. Okay, we made it back. Ah. This is coming... Actually, I think we're already finally coming up to the end of this Let's Play. And just so you guys know, I will not be going after the Legendaries or the Mythicals. Just so you are aware. Yes, we know how this works. Okay. Joltik. Okay, we'll take like this picture. Okay. Okay. Not all bad. We got like some, a lot of Pokemon actually. Some of these are Pokemon I would have probably even considered using in Let's Plays, you know? If I was given the opportunity to use them. Now we're going to go through everything. Starting with the electric, a bug and electric type Pokemon called Joltik. Awesome. Oh, yep, there's Gengar. One of the theory, the very few ghost types that can Mega Evolve, by the way. So if any of you are playing X and Y or Mega Ruby Alpha Sapphire or Sun Moon Ultra Sun Ultra Moon are looking to get like a Mega a ghost type that can Mega Evolve, yeah, get Gengar. It's very good. Ah. Uh. I think a place like this would be good for like rock types and ghost types, I guess. Maybe the occasional poison type. But you know. I don't know my habitat Pokemon, their habitats very well. Okay? I just prefer to catch the Pokemon. Not research them. That's just how I work. Come on. Looks like in the end of night time research. Okay. 
<gasps> I got the profile. Okay. Now we're going to do this again. Because we got to get up there to level 2. So we can per 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 proceed. Got the... Okay. All oh, bad luck. Interesting Pokemon choices here. Let's go for the Carbink. What? There's a mystery Pokemon? Wonder what it could be. Definitely invested in figuring out what this mystery Pokemon is. Yeah. I know it's you, Gengar. Okay. Oh, all bads. Oh, here, Vortex. <gasps> okay, there's a Glalie. Okay, yeah. Apparently I'm decent. At best. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. This is an interesting place. Like, I could never see myself going to places like this, you know? No way. No how. I would probably be dead by then. If I went down here. Heh. <sighs> yeah, so that's why I stay, try to avoid all caves. Okay, we got like some Sableye in here. Anything else? Besides that Gengar? Hi Gengar. Nice seeing ya. And there's like the, the Joltic. Here, hey, food, 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 food. Oh. Oh well. <gasps> Wait. Oh, wait. Ha! Oh, no. <gasps> Noibat! Oh, my God. Yes, the Noibats. That's right. Oh my god, Rampardos. This is a nice cave, honestly. No wonder Diancy would a Pokemon like Diancy would learn to live here. Well, that ain't because of all the car bank, but you know what I mean. Oh my god. Gengar! You fucking thing. Oh. Hmm. Okay, not bad. Working good, Crow Gunk. Oh, sorry, Crobat. <laughs> Man, I'm getting my poison types wrong, and that's obviously not a Crow Gunk. It's a Crobat. <laughs> Yes, Professor. I found a Noibat, though, for you. If you're hungry. I can cook you up a Noibat. Just kidding. I love... I kind of like them. 
They're kind of my friend now. Don't hurt my friend. Oh. 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 Nice. We're fine. We did pretty good. I think I have a little more than enough to fill up the level up in this area. Nice, 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 nice. Not all bad happened here. Sweet, and we got a new Pokemon! Again! Oh my god, this is, this is just nice. Wait, is Noivern in this? I feel like Noivern would be in this. Okay, we're leveled up. Good. We can move on. Look at that, you've hit a new stage! Okay, we got 3,000 photos. What? What is happening? What do I have to do? What? Anger outlet? Gengar the Prankster. Okay. Oh my god. Look at all of this. Did I complete something? Or did I unlock a new research topic? Oh yeah! Wait, hold on. Uh, this. I see. Oh! Hold on, wait, what? Hold on, I gotta also do this. There we go. Ah, feels good. The photo decks. We have done it. We've registered a lot of Pokemon, in fact, in there. Okay. The research camp. What is in- wait. Is it a Starly under there? I think I just solved the mystery of what's underneath there. Look at all. Not a lot of new Pokemon to catch, you know. During. Oh, wait, what? Hold on. Out of register everything. Now it's during the day. This during night. Oh. Okay, not bad. Now let's get this during the Outway Caves. Sweet. Okay. I guess we'll come back here for the cave. Objects of interest. We got more ancient ruins. And another crystal boom. Bloom. I see. <sighs> Hold on. Level two. Level two. Now let's check out this place again because I'm actually seeing if I want to see if there's anything new that will show up there. Just in general. Okay, there's the Noibat. There's some carbink. There's like that. Oh, hey. Hey, Gengar. Wait, what? Wait, what are you doing here? Hi, oh, you little Joltik. Hi, little fella. You pet, you lost the way you lost, you're missing, are you lost from your pack? Ah!
Okay, there's a missing poke. A random... Oh. Yeah, it's you, Gengar. I know it. You can get lost. I'm sorry, what? Why? What else is here? Well, there's the Braviary. And there's Crobat. Oh, and there's... Oh, there's more of those fellas. <gasps> Drifloon! That's new! Anyone else? <laughs> no. Okay. I hope that happened here. Now if he knew. Okay, there's a Ramparos around here. <gasps> oh, there's a Clefairy! Oh! Wait, what? Wait, we're going down here now? Perfect. Mmm. This is nice relaxing music for me as well. I love this. Okay, we got some Sableye. They're after it. Hey. Back off. That's right. Now piss off. You feller. Oh my god, those are crystals? Hold on. Just a second. Those are crystals. Okay. What's over here? Got some Mawile, some Carbink. Um, hi, Mawile. I was wondering, is that like another jaw it's got? Or is that something else? There you go, buddy. Thanks for the photos. There's a lot of crystals here. I just realized that. More than like that. Oh! <gasps> a new form of Vivalon! Jungle pattern! This is nice! I couldn't access this before! Ancient runes. A new set, in fact. Uh, uh. Thank you! Enjoy! Is there nothing else? I actually like that crystal. And alright, the Neo one is set to return. We are going back, guys. And we got some good photos today. In this one. You've seen home at this course now. Go ahead. Oh, sorry. You see me at home at this course on this course now. Go ahead and show some photos for me. With pleasure. In fact, we're going to start with the Drifloon. We're going to move on to the Clefairy. The Mawile. Okay. This Geodude. <gasps> Four Star! And we got some Ruins. There we go. We got everything we need. Perfect. We got a bunch of Pokemon done. Yeah, good stuff. And we got more registries done. Ah, have fun, Clefairy. And that one four-star photo of the of that Vivalon. I love it, actually. I might actually take that with me. And we got a three-star for the Geodude. Now, this is my project. 
Awesome. This is awesome. Nice feeling. Ah. Persever perseverance. Perseverance is a key ingredient of research. You'll have my help every step of the way. Thank you. Giant crystals. By the way, thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I got something to report. I'll follow you on once you've, your photos are squared away. Yeah, thank you. Let's see here. I want this photo and this crystal. Thank you. There we go. Now what are we going to get reported on? Another location or is there a new, new cutscene? Let's find out. Just imagine, plants thriving so deep underground. What wonders the world hides? Professor. Hey, Professor, what was that imp important thing you wanted to tell us? Ah, oh, yes, good news. We've located an aluminum Pokemon on Darius Island. That's right, we picked up that familiar reading coming from a large empty space deeper in the cave. Which means we found our last aluminum Pokemon. You know what to do, trusty photographer. Yep. It's time. Now the real question. It's see what who we get. Now what's Pokemon is it gonna be? Oh. Wait, what? Is it Steelix? Oh my god. I'm glad I'm okay. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh! You think? Oh. Come on! Why? This thing's hard to come through. I need to get some Illumina orbs. Why is this thing so hard?
Oh no. There. Crystal boom. I'm gonna try this spot. Oh no, I feel like it's coming out of that hole. One of these holes has it. No! I couldn't target it! Damn you! How do I hit you? Oh. Oh, Steelix! That really icks me. It really hurts. We're going back. Ah! <gasps> Come back here. Get back and Hey. Can I use those photos? Come on. Air. Food. Well, isn't that a disappointment? How many Lumina Orbs do I have to throw on it, by the way? Huh? Yeah, dumbass. <laughs> Come on. Uh Did I even get a photo? That's right. I hope I got it. If I did, that's good. Okay. Actually, this is a nice photo. These crystals, they're amazing. <sighs> I really hope I got lucky this time. So wait, are we underwater or just in a cave? And you go.
Oh. Ah. Oh! Did I get it? Did I get it? Where the something caught my attention while you were chasing after that silhouette. What was it? Past that broken wall. There appears to be a large open area. The scan says it's not a natural formation. It's human made. It's just begging to be explored. <laughs> oh? What's here? What? Can I get out? <gasps> it's everywhere! Look, it's everyone! Okay. This is awesome. Yeah. It's fine. Yeah, if I come back. Yeah, was the professor okay there? We've got a lot to discuss, but first, let's get your powders evaluated. I can use them. I will use this. It's nice. I think we found every Illumina Pokemon now. Now, yeah, we got Steelix. It's interesting here. Okay. Okay. 